Morning everybody uh, from Provence, nice and early here. Uh, I thought I'd show you the result of the um, grain crush because a few people asked about it and uh, I realised afterwards it probably wouldn't be a bad idea to show the finished crush. Now this grain bill is for an Erdinger clone um, and it's a mix of malted wheat, malted barley and there's some, also some whole wheat in there which is pretty tough stuff actually. And to give you an idea of my crush uh, I'm running this through my rollers twice. Uh, with concrete rollers, centering the axle is, is very difficult. Um, and, you know, despite your best endeavours, you'll probably end up with a slight wobble on the rollers, which I have. Uh, and that can result in a, a bit of a spot every rotation where the odd grain will slip through the gap. Uh, and because of that, I... I tend to double crush. Um, what I'm looking for is to get all the hulls crushed but without too much flour. Um, some look uncrushed but in fact, like that one, when you give them a little squeeze they they have been crushed and uh, what I find is in the mash tun they all you know, make a, a very good mash. I haven't had any problems with stuck mashes or anything like that. Um, now with home malted barley my efficiency is somewhat lower. Uh, my brewery is a pretty good one. I built it myself. It's over here, not quite fixed up yet, but ready to go. And it runs at 70% efficiency all day long with uh, shop bought malt. With home malted and, and home crushed, my efficiency is probably running about 40 45%. Shock horror, everyone says. Well, it, it is low, but. Um, the upside is the grain is so cheap. I mean, man, you know, it's so cheap, it's a total non-brainer for me. So I'm really not bothered. Uh, I buy my grain from my agricultural dealer, dirt cheap, malt it, grind it, make great beer, and uh, benefit as well is all the spent uh, mash goes to feed my chickens, so nothing's wasted at all. Um, anyway, I hope that's of use. Um, it, it can be done, you can malt your own barley. It's not rocket science. And uh, you can build a grain crusher as well. Now, this this Erdinger clone, if you're interested in uh, in the, in making one, I really suggest you have a look at a YouTube channel called uh, Woodland Gardener. Uh, and also, that's where you'll find a lot of information on malting your own barley. I'm not going to bother posting anything because uh, you know he's done a fantastic job. And in fact, I copied his method for my malting, and it, it works fantastically well. So I hope that's of use to you, and uh, see you all soon. Goodbye.